welcome back to the channel. I'm Atari Metalhead, and this is Fallout 4. War. War never changes. I do in love the these opening cinematics that Bethesda does and they put together for this is no different. It's fantastic. Serving this is a brand new release for PS4 when it came out. Wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife. I love how they missed the uh, they mixed the, the reality with the CG and the uh, altered reality. He got his escapes. wish. Very cool. When the U.S. ended World War Always II, impressive, Bethesda. The Speaking of, Hiroshima, if we've watched the series, I got a lot to say about that. Get the preliminary crap out of the way. I'm Atari Metalhead. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button down below. It'd help a whole lot. And if you're a fan of energy drinks like me, then why don't you switch over to something look that's better for your body, man? Zero sugar, natural caffeine, and uh, a bunch of B vitamins. It's good for your brain piece. Just go to w.gg and use my code Atari Metal to get 10% off. I promise you'll like it. Give it a shot. We'll dive right into this with a brand new character. I have no idea what we're going to do with it, though. There's so many options you can go with this. I do know what we'll be skipping because uh, Preston Garvey's a great character and all, but no thanks. The entire world unravel. Welcome to the Rearrange Your Face Simulator 9000. It's got the very Roman nose. This is not me. Knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hun. You think? The default names for these characters, Absolutely. without being now in universe names, are Nate and Nora. Mirror. Right. Pardon me, sir. Yeah, that's close enough. Mm. Neanderthal brow. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. Okay. No. No. What the crap? Man, we could really make this guy look like a complete buffoon. That would be fun, I guess. I have mm. the hazel. Such pretty eyes. Ear holes. Nose holes. Hairstyle. Let's go with the, uh... The Urban Ranger. Mm, this yeah. new haircut's really there working for me. Oh, there we go. That's better. The swashbuckler. The gunslinger. A dashing rogue. <laughs> oh my, it said. No. Oh my god, no. Okay, this is reality. Body. Reality. Video game me. There we go. Song radio. Rocket 69 signal phone. Oh, because they, they, yeah, that's that was my fault. That's a mod. It's, uh, it's where you can change the song selection manually. You can actually skip through the songs, which is kind of cool. There's a newspaper hanging as a towel above the toilet. Whatever, man. The Mr. Handy Box appears to have real corrugated cardboard textures on it. I don't know if that was a thing before, but look, it looks dented and everything. That's pretty good. If that's new, then good job, Bethesda. Here's the laundry. Yeah, let Codsworth take care of it. If you've never played this game before, you should move around the house. Ah, wow. The colors. Everything looks great, man. That 1950s aesthetic really coming in strong. As you move around the house with your character for the first time, you can interact with Codsworth here, which is awesome. Thanks, Codsworth. But uh, you can like click on different things, and he'll say, or she, depending on which character you get, and they say different lines. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Oh, sounds like someone made a sticky. I shall attend to young Sean. Hmm. And you gotta you go know, check on the baby. 
But Cosworth's really good with Sean. Let's just uh, close this up. That way you can also go and check out your closet. This gives you a little backstory hint. The military fatigues. War never changes. <laughs> Got that right. Just let you know that uh, your character here was in the military. Here's baby Sean. Enjoy it looks nothing like you. Sir. Nora's been hoeing around. Spin the red rocket mobile. Hello, little Sean. You enjoy that, don't you? Yes. Now, don't you touch the laundry. <laughs> I'll take care of it. Sorry, this mobile sounds a little loud. I can't hear you, buddy. Cool. No, so here's Mr. vault -Tec himself. Hello. Good morning, vault -Tec Good morning, go away. Like, what kind of character are we going to be here? Just say, good morning, not interested. Go on. I do nice know a you, lot sir. of people don't like the uh, skill tree and the conversation tree text options on Fallout 4. I get it. It's, it's totally different from how it normally urgency. works, like number you. 3 and New Vegas. And they've changed that What's so important? now Why, with 76, which is better. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country this is just one design Anaheim choice that they made for Fallout 4. If you'll excuse my language. We'll be just it's fine kaboom, making these types of conversational choices as this is just I'm a afraid. let's play. And coming sooner than you may think. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being I like his official a, Vault Tech uh, clipboard. That's cool. Precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Total All right, here's the question. What kind of a character are we going to make? One-man army, tank, stealthy guy, ninja dude, just a science nerd. Sure, let's do it. The name. Well, wouldn't you know it? It's going to be us. That's all right. How about that? Strength. Uh, let's be strong. Perception. Let's have good perception. Endurance. But um, this is a good. This is a good base. I think just a good blank slate to start out. Not really going to go for anything specific. This gives us. Charisma to start. Uh, you get an immediate boost of this up to number five from four anyway. Um, intelligence, that's a good way to start. As long as we can uh, keep on boosting our stuff up. Agility is good. We can boost that up. And this is a good base for strength, perception, and endurance. So we'll accept Wonderful. this. That's everything. Uh, just and trigger the bombs. The I mean, congratulations on being prepared. Yeah, bye -bye. Um, thanks again. Hey. It's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moment. I'll buy you the moon and the stars, baby. Sir, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of All right, the I'll do it. Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. And do what exactly? Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? <sighs> Here we go. You had to go and turn followed on the news. By, it's always bad. Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. We seem to have lost contact with say? our affiliate stations. We do, we do have, we do have video. coming in. That's uh, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports hey, of nuclear Sir, detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. Hon? What's going on? Oh my God. There's the oh famous God. police standby fallout the screen. Now! We gotta get Let's the go. hell out of here. Codsworth. Hold down the floor, buddy. I'll see you in 200 years. Residents of Sanctuary Hills. This is a vault tech man, official. Evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. All participants, this way! It's okay. Who cares? Just help me pack it up! 
Roman and Terry. If you notice, it's fall. Leaves in the trees. That's absurd. I am Not on the list. Tech. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop me. Look, it's the vault tech guy okay, we just saw. Okay. He gets turned away. If you're in the program, step We need to get in. We're on the list. We're on your vault tech clipboard, sir. Adult male. Adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, ma'am. And God help Come us on, all. Ladies, let's go. You two, follow me. I'm Come following on. you. What's going to happen to all those people outside yeah, the gate? Everything we can. Now keep done. moving. Can I just ride in the vertebrate? It looks fun. All right, here we go. Really, really beautiful shot. The Leave the collars the on whatever, man. And just in the nick of time, you see, we step on Vault 111's. Almost there. Trap We're going to be okay. And I love you, both of you. We love you too. Oh my God! Hold on. Twenty fifth night, twenty two Okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your Run. new home, Vault One Eleven. This 11. is our new home. A better future underground. So we just uh, yes, up the stairs. It's our new home. Believe it. If we left a minute later, the table will take us in. Female and. Welcome. Pick up a suit Here right you over are. there. Head Just down the hall there. The table. You'll need your suits before we can take you further. Uh, thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. Excuse me. See? This way, please. This is our new home. It's down the hallway right there. Oh, you're there. gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. How much for that Pip-Boy, Doc? It's gone. Our home. Everything Sir? we had. My mother and father down in D.C. How, how long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. Don't you think? Just the checking everyone off the list. Society fashionable as well as comfortable. Who's my little guy? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There he is. See? Daddy's not going far. All set? Just step hey, inside. Son. I think he's better. Place. You go ahead. Hey. Take your time. We've got all day. Okay. Just gonna put on this here vault suit and uh, jump into our time travel machine. Contaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. <sighs> time for a whole new life. Resident secure. <sighs> Occupant vitals. Normal. Procedure complete. In Whoop. five. Whoop. Four. Three. Flesh frozen like two, vegetables. You. 
I'll get you. Just let me get out of this tin can. And then you're frozen again. Great. Two coma naps. <coughs> God, let me out of here. I'm farting. We're melting. Whoop! Gonna puke. Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. Sad. I promise. And if you go and look, you can see all your neighbors, like, dead in their pods. Which is also pretty gross. Nice little touch. Contact your vault tech maintenance representative for service. Giant bugs. Where am I? Oh, there's a stem pack that'll be handy a little bit, probably. Another security baton. We just need the one. Thanks. Giant gross roaches. So much fun. Giant roaches? Yes, giant roaches. What the hell? This is no time for video games. We're playing a video game. Eject the holotape, you can keep it. So you can just goof off with it later. It's kind of fun. I think that was a Space Invaders clone. Hello, roaches. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Well, that was fun. Aha. This all that's left. Oh, I'll definitely take that. And that, thank you. I do like the uh, the weapon wheel. It's really it's really pretty uh, pretty useful. Cryolator. I've long dreamed of making cryogenic freezing available in a portable, on-demand form. Thankfully, you're not a master expert at lockpicking yet. The cryolator is here, but you have to have master lockpick skill to get it. So you gotta come back for it later. Uh, here's an extra 10mm pistol we can take for spare parts. Just some more ammo. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's blow this popsicle stand, eh? God, just so many roaches. Somebody should hire an exterminator. Use R3 to sneak. You can do increased damage. Move slowly and kill it with vengeance. Yeah. <coughs> Dead. Oh, hey, Doc. Notice you're not using this Pip Boy anymore, huh? Don't mind if I do. I think this one's my favorite design still. It just looks sleek. Smash that button. Just like you guys should smash that subscribe. Smash. There we go. There's that old panel. 
So it gives you the second option here to change your appearance if you're not happy with what you made or now that you know that this is your special attribute settings. Uh, anyway, we're happy with what we have. It's a good start, a good base character, so let's get out of here. Thank you for choosing vault -Tec. We'll sleep you again soon. There's gonna be, <laughs> there's gonna be a whole bunch of uh, weirdo side quests that are popping up immediately for no reason, that don't make any sense because uh, we have some mods and some extra quests downloaded. <sighs> anyway, here's Sanctuary. Over there's the red rocket, as you can see. Um, raid everything. If you guys have followed along with my 76 play, then um, you know I am a klepto when it comes to Fallout games. I have this terrible need to grab everything in sight. Yep. They never made it in the gate. Sad. Some silt beans. I think I have a mod where you can make coffee out of these. Sanctuary. Oh look, there's Codsworth. As I live and breathe. Oh, it's it's really you. Everything's dead. Spoken like Everything a true survivor dead. of the apocalypse. Ah, yeah. I think there's like Your a small speech check here. It gives you a little bit of charisma Not XP. Properly, years will do that, I love the afraid. texture mapping on Codsworth. It looks awesome. 200 years? What? Are you? A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or give and take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> That means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. <laughs> you must be famished. Speech check. Codsworth, you're acting. This is just an example, but you still get the a XP bit for weird. it. Weird. What's wrong? I. I. Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything. Suddenly he's the one that's in control and totally aware of his emotions. Yeah, hurry. whatever. I that I don't buy. It's, it's, it's fine, whatever. It's a video game, man. It's a video game. Dead. Here's your first real side quest. Just following around the neighborhood. Anyway, we can take this opportunity to loot some stuff. Obviously. Which is what we're going to do. Some blood flies and such. Cosmo is cool because he has that little flaky guy. Yeah. Handy dandy. Here's a toaster. Uh, some bubblegum. Okay. Completed. Kill the insects. You are the exterminator. Welcome to Fallout 4. A new Coca Cola. Some pork and beans. Alright. Already getting some stuff. It's okay. There's more stuff to be had around the neighborhood. Thanks for trying. Codsworth. You can't give up, sir. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. Pre-war money is always good to hang on to for your pocket liner. Hmm, yes. We're just gonna run around. You can now use the workshop. Okay, now this is where all this crap comes into play that turned into what Fallout 76 is with everybody's camps and everything. So this this all started on Fallout 4. Um, it's fine. I don't need anything other than... Oh, and the scrapping thing, right? So I forget. That's something that was just in 76. And as you can see, our giraffiums are still the envy of Sanctuary Hills. 
So he's outside of our home. And here is that magazine. There we go. It's a permanent upgrade to our character. Looks like the box has been turned around. I mean, 200 years will do that, I guess. Anyway, we go in here, we can find the special book and we can boost our something. So I'm gonna go ahead and use it to boost the charisma because it's super handy in this game. Super handy in every game, honestly. A roach. Here we go. And this works just like the mini game for the Fallout 76 one. You just gotta hold your tongue correctly there, Atari. There we go. Nice. Why not? There we go. If you want to, you can take this dude's stuff. Um, the Drifter outfit's really not that better than what you already have equipped. I'm just gonna leave it alone. It's a cool aesthetic. He died defending himself from the dog, is what it appears to be. Here's the red rocket of fabled legend. Hello, dog. Dog meat. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You lose your owner, buddy. Oh, yeah. Faithful companion. Okay, then. Let's stick together. Hey. How you doing, buddy? Eh, never mind, boy. We have our first official companion. He's like, hey, check this out. There's a stem pack. There's another stem pack. There are stem packs of bounds in this game. How they're harder to come by in other games, I understand, but man. So you can't use the workshop here until you clear it out. Oh, or can you? Okay. Well, I guess it's already cleared out then. All right. Whatever. Makes no sense. We're just gonna leave that alone. I like the way it looks. Okay then. We're just gonna shut this down. Got a new home. Scrap one of these. So this does 18 damage, and this does 13 damage. We're going to stick with the 18 damage 10 millimeter. And we go ahead and bust that out because we got some. Oh, proper vats. Man. Have I missed this? Oh, that's awesome. The Volta Assisted Targeting System. Dead. Dead. Oh, that's rules. Good job. Good job, dog. Mmm, cram. There's all kinds of stuff to do here in just a little bit. And we'll get to it soon. So. Dog butt. Wow, we slept for a good while here. Go ahead and get a couple things out of the way. So, yep, we're good. Right off. We're going to go into the mole rat den. Into the mole rat den we go. Bats. Dead. 
dead. I love it down here. I really do. I love it. It's not crazy irradiated or nothing. Get him, dog. Awesome. A lot of radiation here, but you get a fusion core out of it, so that's pretty good. And here is another 10 millimeter and a couple rounds. Getting some rads. It's not too bad, though. On behalf of the Boston Regional Office, I would like to congratulate you and your team on winning the 2076, there's some good lore, Trash Busters Award for the greatest year-to-year -year waste reduction by a single store. And here's where it was all going. Oh, my God. All right. Uh, this game here, I tell you, is really different from how the other Fallout games do you with, like, power armor and stuff. In New Vegas, I remember that one, you had to uh, go through some things. We're just going to skip down to Electric Avenue. So, typically the game would lead you in this direction to go through uh, through Concord, Concord down here. But, we are going to skip most of this. Could you not? That's gross. Jesus. Avoiding the firefight that may be taking place. Hey, wait there. Yep. Tell dog meat to hang out here, and we can sneaky sneaky up on top of the roof over here. Let's see. There's Preston Garvey and some raiders. We're gonna avoid them completely by doing this. do about things. Over here is where we're aiming for, right? So there's a crashed bird a bird and here we go. Let's go ahead and save this just in case. A little quick save. Jump. We're going to aim for the vertebrate tail. So if we screw up, we've just saved it. Ah, there we go. Just made it. Bam! You're on top of the whatever this is. We can grab that if we want to. There's a gas canister anyway. The main reason for being up here is to go ahead and... Oh, look, it's a whole entire suit of T-45 power armor. Sands a power all core. And so we just slap in this fusion core we stole from underneath the red rocket. And there you go. Power armor. Anyway, so we can do this and steal the minigun. And uh, bye bye And hey, me. come on. Let's go. And we have this. And we have this. Makes a nice little loop de loop. Go away, dog. All right. And yeah, we're home. can here of the power armor to bring it back to its full glory and potential. Uh, the torso requires some more stuff. Uh, looks like we need one circuitry. Um, no, I really thought the toaster would have circuitry. Aha! The telephone. There we go. 
No. Fix you right up there, pal. There we go. Alright, so. Episode 1 complete. Here we go. We got the power armor. Sans Preston Garvey. In all of its rust bucket potential. It's T45, so it's not the best, but it is dope. I mean, look at that. That's awesome. Title screen intact. All right, so for now, we're just going to leave off. We're going to save this, and next time we will go adventure and proper and wander into the wasteland. See what we can get into next time on Fallout 4. Until then, thanks for watching.